It is a privilege for me to welcome you to the 2021 Conrad N. Hilton Humanitarian Prize Ceremony. It was over 26 years ago when fellow board member Jim Galbraith first approached my father, Baron Hilton. The thought was to establish a prize that would honor his father, Conrad's, lifetime humanitarian efforts. It was decided that this would be awarded not to an individual, but to a nonprofit organization that had significantly helped to alleviate human suffering. CAMFED, along with the 25 laureates who have received this prize, have tackled some of the world's most pressing problems. They also embody the values of both Conrad and Barron. Integrity, thinking big, humility, compassion, and stewardship. I was so excited that CAMFED was this year's recipient. Their model of educating marginalized young girls exemplifies not only the values, but the vision of the Hilton Foundation. That is, a world in which improving the human condition is a shared and sustainable goal. CAMFED's proven strategy in educating and empowering young women has helped in combating poverty and inequality. I am so pleased that for the first time, the prize is recognizing an organization that prioritizes education and empowerment for girls. To quote Nicholas Kristof, no force changes the world more than a girl with a book. CAMFED not only provides the most marginalized children with the support and means to academically succeed, but they have also brought together their alumni to help carry it forward. In addition, they have engaged both community members and parent groups to help in these efforts. Angeline Muri Mirwa is a shining example of the Camp Fed effect. As one of the first young women who received her education through Camp Fed support, Angeline has shown all of us what achievement looks like. She was given an opportunity to attend school and the encouragement needed to succeed. And now she is passing that on to others. This multiplier method is the key to the success of the CAMFED program. As a founding member of the CAMA Association and their first elected chair, Angeline now serves as executive director of CAMFED Africa. Her story is an inspiration to all of us. I know my grandfather and father would be so proud today to see a prize given to an organization that serves vulnerable children, especially girls giving them the tools to lead successful lives, CAMFED is creating a better world through education. Remember, when you educate a girl, everything changes. And with that, I would like to say to the entire CAMFED team, congratulations.